I've, I've got... I've got no doubt formative assessments have been used for generations in schools. I understand that. My issue is that you collect them and you produce a national report, and that national report is now leading to crude league tables being published. And in fact, one of the First Minister's schools in her own constituency was highlighted as one of the apparently worst performing schools in the country. I don't believe it for a minute. I believe that school is probably performing well. But because of their demographics and their background, it's assessed as one of the worst schools. Now, that surely can't be good for the Scottish education system. If you stopped collecting this data on a national basis, stopped using it for monitoring purposes and allowed teachers to continue to use it at a local level, surely that would be the best of all worlds. So why aren't you, why aren't you stopping collecting the information? So I think it's very important that we do have data and we have the correct data and that allows uh, teachers to be able to make um, a, an informed judgment about how well a pupil is progressing. Um, it allows head teachers to be able to, to assess what's happening within their schools. I think at a local authority level it's, it's also um, useful for that and it's important that we have information at a government level to see, again as I was discussing earlier, if there's a concern around the variation of outcomes for children. 